I believe everyone here is entitled to, as the Constitution states, a presumption of innocence. And I think it's important that we fight for our clients and it's important that we demonstrate to them and to everyone else that this is someone who is presumed innocent and is deserving of a bond. What I will need to see first is actually the evidence, the discovery, the police reports, uh, body cam footage, whatever there may be. Um, there are certainly rules governing when a statement to a police officer is admissible and when it's not. I certainly do think it is a shame that this situation has turned into a political football that's being kicked around by a lot of people for their own benefit rather than sort of focusing on the facts of what may or may not have happened here. Again, it's really too early to say. Certainly this is a, an issue that is at a flashpoint in our society, and I don't think it can help but have some impact. But I think it's really too early to judge what that is going to be. Certainly it's something I'm concerned about.